I'm Corinne. I'm Thomas. <laughs> Good morning and welcome to the show spot. I am Drake and this is Corinne. Morning. How are you? I'm doing great. Pumped? Pumped I, up? I am because it is almost time for CNA Fest. I know. It's like one of those things, I'm so excited, I'm so excited, I'm so excited, I'm so anxious. Mm -hmm. ah! But I'm really excited <laughs> for CNA Fest. Um, one of my favorite parts about CNA Fest is the awards banquet. And we're going to talk about that a little bit today. Key to Quality Awards Banquet is something where we, is an event at CNA Fest where we recognize CNAs from across the nation. And we wanted to talk about some of the categories. This segment of the Chill Spot will be two parts. So this is part one. Mm -hmm. And then we will air part two as well. Mm -hmm. So make sure you tune in because you're only going to get half of it here. So the awards banquet, formal attire. Yes. Red carpet event. Yes. Get a look cute. Get mm -hmm. to do your hair. Yeah. Shave. Get your girdles out. Get your girdles out. <laughs> Oh, I couldn't say what I was going to say. Hey, no, I had mine my on, and if I'll be honest, if it wasn't for Drake that kept telling me, hey, you're sticking out on the side, I would have been really embarrassed going up there announcing an award. You, with, I, that's with one thing, you know, out. I have a built, comfortable <laughs> relationship with my friends and my peers, mm -hmm. and I don't, if you got some in your teeth, anything like that, I'm going to tell you, because I don't want somebody to tell you that doesn't know you, and that will be weird. Right. So, we are going to, we're not going to go into... The description of the awards. We're going to pull up some pictures, and while the we're scrolling through the pictures, we're going to read the title of eight awards, right. and then we will do mm -hmm. on part two the uh, the remaining awards. These awards are all things that you can nominate yourself for. You can nominate someone else for through our website, and the nominations are due. By, I'm going to say it on here um, and the July, next one. July the 24th. July 24th. So mm -hmm. get in there, write them. Write as many as you can because I love getting them and I love reading <laughs> them. And I want the decisions to be difficult because there are so many yes. quality caregivers mm -hmm. in this world. So let's nominate everybody. And then Nock is going to be like reading them for a month. <laughs> so we're going to start with reading the ones we have. The first one that you can nominate for is Estella. Parish Lifetime Achievement Award. Mm -hmm. And then we have a Member of the Year Award. A Assisted Living Caregiver of the Year. Champion of the Year. Bobby Hartgrave Rookie of the Year. Preceptor of the Year. CNA Academic Excellence. And Excellent in Leadership. Excellence. Excellent. <laughs> in Leadership. Those are the first eight. <laughs> On our website, you can go to the nomination tab and it will give you a description of every award that is out there to be nominated for. Again, please nominate your peers. If you're an administrator, a DON, nominate your staff. At your next resident council meeting, tell your residents about it because residents can nominate CNAs too. Tell the residents, family members about it, people in the community. There's never too many nominations, and it's a great thing to recognize people. I had the privilege of presenting an award last year for the first time, mm -hmm. and I think I was more nervous than the recipient mm -hmm. because it's a big deal for them. So I wanted to make sure everything I said about them was accurate. It was like strong as they were walking to the stage. So I was really nervous. I look forward to this year presenting another award. Yeah. I don't know if I get to. I mean, if I get to, but... Hey, Lori, I'm presenting an award this year. <laughs> um, so nominate for those. Be sure to tune in for part two of this because we're going to list some more awards, I think, about mm -hmm. six more maybe. Yes. Go on our website and read the description and nominate people. I think I said nominate people 16 times, so it'll be stuck in their head. Yeah. And um, <laughs> don't think that you don't have a chance because, mm -hmm. you know, we never know who's, who's going right. to win. And I do believe that when you write a nomination out, so that makes 17 times, we said it. <laughs> and on your nomination, which is 18 times, they actually, I do believe they cross out the name and the facility. So all you see is what's Oh, are you saying like in the judging? About. Yes. Yes. And they're just reading the nomination. It is an outside source outside of our team here at NACA. 
non-biased. They're reading the actual nomination and they're making the selection off of that. So please, please, please read the awards. There are several categories that people can be nominated for and they're going to love you forever when they hear you nominated them and they win. Yeah, and if you if you're uncertain about which category to um, put this person in, put them in all of them. Yeah, just you know if you're <laughs> kind of fit, that if, fit. Yeah, if you're kind of undecided, um, you know you can reach out to me. You can reach out to Drake. You can reach out to any of the board members, and also um, a few shows back, you mentioned about the Naka um, Edge being out, mm -hmm. and in um, the episode that you did that you sent out, you can also go back and scan through there. And it has the complete definition of, you know, all of the awards. Yes. I have, you know, that's something I have been worried about, I guess would be the word in the Naka edge for the last few months. I have left all of the nominations in there and I've changed, I've done different articles on different things to fit the month, but the stuff about CNA Fest has stayed the same. I don't want you guys to get tired of seeing it, but I want to make sure everybody gets the opportunity to have a chance to see it, and we get new people that receive the edge every month. So she's very correct. Right. Go into the last newsletter that was sent to you, which for May, it was sent out on May 2nd. Go look at that newsletter and every award and its description is listed there. And then you can follow a link to enter your nomination right from the newsletter. Right. So that, that that's one thing that I did notice when I was reading. It's like, if you have that thought in your mind, don't hesitate. Just hit on that yeah. and then do it. And we are receiving mm -hmm. nominations daily. And I, I just love it. Yeah. And one award that I wanted to point out that we mentioned was actually the first award that you um, said was the Stella Parish. That's the ward and that's the person that started the ball rolling yes, yes. for Naka. That's a big one. Mm -hmm. So it'd be a privilege to win any, but especially that one. Yes. So if you haven't got your nominations in, get your nominations in for sure. Tune in to the next chill spot where we're going to talk about a few more. Yep. And nominate your caregivers again. <laughs> <laughs> so we'll see you next time. We're going to talk about mm -hmm. Key to Quality Awards again. So yep. until then, nominate your CNAs. Yep. <laughs> Thank you.